more than what we expected. It's such an incredible experience and we couldn't ask for any more really. We just went out there to gain experience, see what it's like and just yeah, become Olympians and having this medal around our necks has just topped it. It's the most biggest stage and publicised event in the whole world and just to have the opportunity to compete at it, it was an amazing opportunity and really incredible to be around. Uh, then this was our like first world um, event and her first major and my second so um, being around all them amazing gymnasts still motivates us and inspires us to uh, do what they're doing and just show, it really shows where we stand in the world ranking and how much we need to improve and where we stand. Yeah, it's really like opened our eyes and made us realise how good we are and where we are ranked in the world. So going back to the gym, we know if we want to get hit those medals, we've got to upgrade and work like so much harder, even though we've done incredibly well so far. So I think um, there is a world champion um, tips um, later this year and um, we're not sure if we will try and make it. We'll just have to see what the future holds, really. We just want to get back in the gym and improve and just become the best gymnast we can be. We're taking each step as it comes. Yeah, we're so, so excited to see everyone back at home. It's, it has been a very, very long time not seeing them, but um, we're coming back home for everyone to be proud of us and come back with it more experience and more excitement and just can't wait to give them all a big hug and show my medal to them and just um, feel um, that homeliness. Yeah, it's been like quite different that there isn't spectators, but then we also haven't done a lot of major competitions. Like this is my first, this is her second. And even on Jess's first, there wasn't that much spectators. So we're actually kind of used to having no spectators. But I think it will really change once we, like, everything goes back to normal and we do hit those big competitions. And like Jess said, so excited to, like, go back home and see our family. And, yeah, soon we'll find out our GCSE results. And we're also going to turn 17 soon, so we can't wait to start driving either. Uh, it's um, more than what I've ever dreamt of. And I never really set myself um, to win a medal at the first Olympics I've ever done, but to achieve that, it's exceeded my expectations of what I can do. Yeah, I still can't believe it, and it's just um, so surreal, and I couldn't ask for any more, really. Like, first Olympics, and coming away with bronze, and uh, as a team, like, um, that hasn't been achieved in a really long time, I think, like, 93 years, so we've made history, and just, incredible and to be honest that I, I don't think we would have been able to do it without Emily and Alice and Jen as well. We all played the, our part in that team and it just made magic.